I really like this hip pack. Today I'm going to talk about a new hip pack that I've received from the lab. I like it a lot. Um, I actually like it better than the other hip pack that I reviewed. This one has two spots for water bottles, which is amazing. I've used it in the cold to carry four water bottles on long rides. I've also used it in the heat to carry four water bottles. Once down in Florida and another time in Bentonville. And I think I've actually also used it here in kind of medium temperature for a long ride with four water bottles. So that means two bottles on the bike and two in this hip pack. And I really like the hip pack as opposed to a backpack. It's less sweaty in the heat because it's just around your hip as opposed to the hydration pack on your back. So I'm really excited to share this hip pack with you and I'm gonna show it to you right now. So this is what it looks like right here. Okay. Lab, the lab makes it uh, right there. That's the brand. It has a spot, a Velcro pocket in the back side here. It has a zipper pocket in the front, which also has a sleeve inside this pocket to hold something like your cell phone a little more tight. It also has another Velcro pocket in the front, which I carry a couple of things in. And it's stretchy, so it's the one thing I was kind of hesitant about, but I really like now is that it does stretch and flex. So I can carry quite a bit of stuff in here. I've got a hand pump in this side. I'll just show you. It's cool. This is my hand pump. It also works as a CO2 pump. So I've got my CO2s in here as well. I've got a few of my big CO2 cartridges in here. I also have a tire lever in here just in case. I've got one of these super duper plugs. I think that's it on there. Just a few more CO2s in there, just in case. You know, you never know. CO2s are awesome. Oh, there's something else. There. What's this? Oh, spare valve stem. <laughs> it's kind of funny. I forgot that was in there. On the other side, in this pocket, I carry tissue. I carry tire boot. I also carry some money in there just in case I run out of a tire boot because money is good to buy a tube from someone and it's also good to use as a tire boot. Uh, the tissue in there is just in case you have to go to the bathroom. It's also good for if you have to, oh look I got another valve stem. If you have to dry your tire out to put the tube in or to be able to get the boot to stick to the tire if you get a slit in it which can happen when you're in rocky terrain. So tissue is always good. Carry my multi-tool in here. I also carry a patch kit just in case the tube gets another puncture in it. So I got a patch kit. It also has room for more stuff if you want. But I also carry my, in this front Velcro one, I put the extra tube in here. And then it also has a couple of pockets on the sides, which you can put extra stuff in. Tissue could fit in there. Um, there's one on the other side too here, which is kind of nice. Let me grab two bottles. Put, put the lids on these bottles so you can kind of get an idea of how secure they are. So these are good full-size bottles. I use this hip pack and did some jumps and the bottles did not fly out. So, They go in further than I thought. You can see because they're empty, they're a little harder to get to push in, but when they've got fluid in them and it's on your back, but check that out. It's a really nice, durable hip pack. I've used it for a while now. I wanted to use it for a little bit so that I could get a good review on it and not just, hey, I just got this. I've had this and now I've put it through the paces. So. I really like it. It's a good hip pack, so highly recommend it. I'll show you some video footage of where I've used it, and I'll take a few extra pictures and put it on there so you can check that out. If you like it, I'll also have a link in the description where you can go and grab one for yourself.
This pack actually saved me in Florida when climbing a hill and I snapped a pedal off. I was carrying extra pedals that day in the front Velcro pocket. It also saved me from a flat on the back 40 and a bad bell stem on the Tunnel Vision Trail in Bentonville. Here are some footage of some of those rides. I will also leave you with snapshots of the longer Strava rides in which I use the hip pack with bottles. Slidey rock. Then we come up to the cliffs. The cliffs of Moria. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite hip pack is that holds water bottles. I really like this pack and I really like swapping the full bottles out for empty ones. I'll have a link in the description to some cool bike books that I've read and to the GoPro I use. If you like bikes, help support the channel and grab some bike stickers, I put them on my vehicles. Also look in the description below for my $10 ebook, Getting Started in Mountain Biking, Your First 90 Days. It'll make your life easier, and right now, it's free. Stay tuned for more epic bike content in the coming videos, and don't miss out by subscribing and clicking the bell so you get notified when they are released. Click on one of these videos to continue your bike journey.